Still keeping an eye on one of the city's biggest hospitals after it rerouted some of its emergency room patients. And this is all due to a water leak. Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez has been following the developments all morning long and joins us now live with the very latest. Kathy, good morning. Good morning. Right now, the emergency room remains close to ambulances as crews assess the damage and make repairs to that water leak. For now, though, patients that are walking up can still get the help they need. A part of the emergency room at Bentop Hospital closed. Ambulances not allowed to drop off patients. A hospital spokesperson says there was a water leak on an upper floor last night. Appearing to be an accident, a contractor doing maintenance stepped on a water supply sprinkler system, they say. Doctors were forced to move 97 patients on that floor to another part of the hospital. Since then, Bentop closed the emergency room for ambulance traffic. Patients who came on their own still received the help they needed. A hospital spokesperson says on average, 12 ambulances come to their emergency room on Sunday nights. Instead, last night, they sent them to other hospitals. And of course, we'll keep you updated on when the ER will open up for ambulances. Reporting live in the Texas Medical Center, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.